Have you ever found yourself just sitting down on the floor and eating flowers? Big, thick, petaled magnolias and roses? Their juice spilling down the edge of your lips? They taste like perfume and feel like cold, fresh gardens in your chest and your stomach. That's how I feel when I write. Like I'm picking out fat flowers right out of my laptop screen. Like I'm growing them out of pen and paper instantaneously. Sweet, sugary flowers fill my nose and my eyes and immediately my mouth starts watering. Oof, the way words affect me. The way they make me feel. The way they transform from gibberish on my keyboard to actual living, breathing beings. Like cats purring against the walls of my brain, rubbing their necks in lazy contentment. Like sparrows hopping around delicately, twittering under my fingernails. Like caterpillars climbing up my spine, filling every part of me with soft-spoken fairy tales. How precious every word is. How beloved is each breath that follows each sound and brings me closer to you and brings you closer still to me. Listen to my conversation, its melody and its rhythm. We're telling stories just standing here leaning against the wall and drinking chai in the heat. How crazy is that? How explosively fantastic that I am kissing my words away to you in exchange the ones behind your tongue and tooth. Right here, in public. We're practically making love in the middle of the afternoon. Don't you get it? Don't you see that if God punished Adam and Eve to suffer on earth for the rest of eternity, he made a big mistake giving them words. Because look at us. Look at what we did. We built language into our own paradise for humanity.